So this system is part of our intake mechanism, and the current iteration involves two opening flaps that allow the block to come in. Um, it utilizes two wheels at the front that both spin inwards, uh, which propels the block into the robot. Uh, and currently we're using rubberized wheels and a and, uh, spring-loaded mechanism in the back using rubber bands that allow it to retain tension when it's like opening and closing. One of the main considerations that we made for this design was the wheel choice. So we started out with two-inch stealth wheels, and we found that while it was good at picking up blocks straight on, when you turned it at an angle, the radius was too small to actually if effectively pick up the block. Um, so we changed to a four inch stealth wheel instead. And here we found that without compliance, um, it was really easy for the block to just skid along the outside of the wheels without actually getting pulled in. So then we switched to uh, custom made compliance wheels, which are able to grip the block from a different angle and still be able to pull it in. Um, Another consideration that we made was the frame of our actual intake. So originally this was a rigid frame in a rigid U-shape uh, and it was harder for the blocks to come in because it wasn't able to expand for uh, different, look, different uh, directions of the block as we were intaking. Uh, so instead, we made it a joint system with a spring-loaded mechanism so that when the block comes in at a different angle, we're able to expand a little bit to allow for that description. Uh, so one of the improvements that you can make for this design is to change the wheel type to a more standardized rubber size, uh, or more standardized rubber type uh, that's able to grip the, the block better and intake it in a lot more efficiently. Uh, one of the flaws that we saw a lot was that when we intake the block to a certain point, it would sometimes rotate 90 degrees and come in flat. Um, and one of the ways that we're planning to fix this is to add uh, sidewalls on either side so that once you intake it, it's stuck in that uh, vertical position instead of being able to rotate when it comes in.